Princess Anne cancelled a royal engagement in Uganda after a tragic fire broke out at Salama School for the Blind, the site of her upcoming visit. The royal is on a four-day long tour with her husband Vice Admiral Sir Tim Lawrence and was due to visit the school on Friday. A spokesperson for Buckingham Palace said, as a result of the tragic fire at the school on Monday, her royal highness will now visit the charity at its head office in Kampala where Her Royal Highness will meet charity representatives and families it supports. The Princess Royal will have an opportunity to pay her respects to those affected. Her Royal Highness added, I was shocked to hear the news of the tragic loss of life. The work of Sense International across many countries is hugely appreciated, working with such a vulnerable group of children. Our thoughts and prayers are with the families and staff. Police in Uganda are currently investigating the fire that killed 11 children and injured a further seven. The fire reportedly broke out a barred window, preventing easy escape. Princess Anne is currently on her first overseas tour since the heartbreaking death of her mother, Queen Elizabeth II. Her visit to Uganda marks the country's 60th anniversary of independence from Britain earlier this month. On day one, the royal couple visited the Medical Research Council Uganda Virus Research Institute and London School of Hygiene and Tropical Medicine, Ugandan Research Unit. During their visit, Princess Anne and Sir Tim Lawrence learnt more about the unit's work in producing high-quality research that contributes to the development of strong health policies for the control of infectious and non-communicable diseases. On Wednesday, the Princess Royal opened Opportunity Bank Uganda Nakivale branch at the Nakivale Refugee Settlement, unveiling a plaque to mark the special occasion. Later in the day, Princess Anne paid a visit to Unleashed Youth Employment Project to meet refugee entrepreneurs who have benefited from Opportunity Bank loans. Meanwhile, Princess Anne is known as the Princess Royal, which has always been a special title in the royal family. Keeping to her promise she hasn't left the Queen's side since Her Majesty passed away aged 96 on Thursday in Balmoral in Scotland. The Princess Royal has had the honor of accompanying her late mother on her slow journey back to London, since she left Balmoral for the last time on Sunday. Also Princess Anne made history at the Queen's Vigil in Edinburgh by becoming the first female member of the royal family to stand guard at the royal mourning tradition known as the Vigil of the Princes. In military uniform, she stood alongside her brothers Prince Edward, Prince Andrew and newly appointed King Charles III at St Giles Cathedral in Edinburgh on Monday. Now we take a look at why Princess Anne received the special title Princess Royal and what it mean the Queen bestowed her daughter with the title the Princess Royal in June 1987 a name she will now keep for the rest of her life. It is typically the title given to the eldest daughter of a reigning monarch, and the title is not hereditary. Born on August 15 in 1950 in London, Princess Anne has a special place in the royal family, as the only daughter of the Queen and the Duke of Edinburgh. She is one of four children and the second child. At the age of 18, the Princess Royal embarked on public engagements in 1969. Her very first engagement was the opening of an educational and training centre in Shropshire in 1969. Although Princess Anne's title is for life, other members of the royal family have seen their titles change since the Queen's death. Charles now becomes King Charles III, and the Duchess of Cornwall will be known as the Queen Consort, reflecting the changes in their roles since the Queen's death. Prince William and Kate will now be known as the Princess and Princess of Wales. They were formerly known as the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge. Also the children will still be Prince George, Princess Charlotte and Prince Louis but of Wales, instead of of Cambridge. Kate is the first person to receive the title of the Princess of Wales since Princess